start the orc's pants, I'm using a base coat of black with just a touch of caiman green added in about a 6 to 1 ratio. This gives me a nice dark color that will provide contrast and also works well with the natural color scheme that I've chosen overall. For the first highlight, I add a little more caiman green to the mix, making it roughly two parts black to one part green. And notice that the color difference is a little more subtle than previous layers, and I'm using multiple coats to get the desired color. For the final highlight, I'll add just a touch of Menoth White Highlight to the first highlight mixture. I'm going to keep these highlight lines very thin and just on the uppermost edges. Just for fun, I'm going to add a glaze to the pants as well. This is going to be just a straight Cayman Green wash brushed onto the surface of the pants. The effect is very subtle, but adds just a little more of a green color. For the boots, I'll start with a base coat of black and Vallejo charred brown in a 50-50 mix. This base coat color will also serve as our shadow layer. For the highlight, I use straight charred brown. And finally, I'll add a little Blood Tracker Brown to the Charred Brown for the last highlight. Now that our orc is dressed for battle, we can move on to part five, painting weapons and armor.